Governor Ralph Basham, who was the head of the Secret Service just before Mark Sullivan, uh, the current director. He spent 31 years in the Secret Service. Uh, Mr. Basham, let me ask you, I mean, the question people are asking, is this just some sort of an anomaly, or has this thing been going on all the time? Uh, did you have these kind of problems with your agents when you were there? Uh, uh, Bob, absolutely not. And, and I will tell you um, uh, absolutely that uh, this is an aberration. This is not uh, the character of the men and women who serve uh, every day in the Secret Service. And, uh, and obviously, uh, this is a huge uh, story. It's a huge issue uh, because uh, this sort of thing does not happen. Uh, in the Secret Service, and and I could answer Senator. I think I can say to Senator Lieberman that that I don't believe in the past these types of things have happened. Uh, they certainly didn't happen on my watch. And I spent over three decades in this organization, and I can tell you, this is not what that organization is like. So, uh, uh, but you had you know supervisors involved here. These weren't rookies. Uh, these were supervisors who obviously got to be supervisors some of that time. They must have been in the service. You were the director. You're, you're saying that there was never any indication of anything like this uh, when you were there? Uh, well, Bob, that's not to say that, that we did not have uh, situations where agents, uh, uh, officers uh, got themselves into uh, inappropriate situations uh, and had to be brought back. Uh, and, and in some cases, uh, uh, the di discipline went all the way to, uh, to re uh, removing them from, from the service. Uh, but, but to this magnitude, uh, absolutely not, and 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 what makes it uh, even more uh, 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 of, a, of an issue is the fact that it was done prior to the president's arrival, which could have compromised uh, the the, uh, the, uh, the the trip and the safety of the president. But but Mark Sullivan uh, took immediate and decisive action, just as Senator Lieberman said, uh, removed those agents from uh, Cartagena. Uh, and did immediate investigation to check to, to determine whether or not the president's security had been uh, been compromised. He uh, recognized they could not. I'm sorry. Uh, I was just going to say, how many uh, agents were removed for things like this while while you were there? I uh, well, actually, I can't recall one uh, instance where. Uh, the action uh, w went to the point of removing uh, an agent from uh, from duty. There were uh, agents who were disciplined, uh, you know, given time off, uh, that 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 sort of thing. Mm -hmm. But I can't recall one uh, actually uh, being removed. And uh, but but also I want to uh, uh, point out that that when Mark Sullivan uh, made that decision to bring those agents out of there, uh, he recognized that they could not remain there because they yep. would be distracted. Uh, they would attract others, and you cannot have these agents uh, uh, distracted when they're in the business of protecting the President of the United States. Do you? He's doing a thorough investigation. Go ahead. Now, I was just going to say, do you think that uh, the agency has been uh, severely damaged by this? Uh, uh, it's obviously, it's a teaching moment, as people would say, but uh, I wonder if their credibility hasn't been hurt pretty bad by this. And I agree with you. These are some of the best of the best in the in the federal government. Right. Right. Well, like I, you, Bob, you've been around uh, the agents uh, as, as long as I have, and you know what the uh, the character of those uh, agents are. And certainly, this uh, uh, incident uh, is a, a extremely uh, embarrassing uh, incident, but it is an incident. And, and, and I believe if you look back at the history of the Secret Service, uh, you, you've got to recognize that this is not characteristic of the organization. They'll get through this, they'll learn from this, and they'll move on uh, to the important business uh, that, that of protecting uh, this nation's uh, leaders. Well, Mr. Basham, I want to thank you for coming on. I wish it could have been under different circumstances, but perhaps there will be a time down the road when, when we'll have happier things to talk about. Thank you so much for I, being uh, with I, us. You're welcome, Bob. Thank you.